Jesus never treated sickness or disease like it was part of God's plan for anyone. Never. He always treated it as a work of the enemy. But yet we have people who, who are confused. They have certain mindsets about the sovereignty of God that have become detached from the revelation of the kingdom of God and the revelation of who God is in Jesus Christ. We've been taught to use the Bible like a, like a source for uh, pulling verses out that we can put on our clipboard. And we have our own little organizational structure according to our denominational tradition. And we have all these verses that seem to support what we say. And this is like those little cars that I made. They don't match what's on the box. Jesus is the Word made flesh. So we need to humble ourselves and to say God looks like Jesus. Amen? God does what Jesus does. And God is our help in times of trouble. He's not our trouble. He's our healer, not our afflictor. He's not given. You know, Peter was a numbskull, right? A lot of the apostles were. And yet we got so many people say, I think God's just trying to teach me something through this sickness. Well, okay, wait a second. Peter says, you know, Lord, this will never happen to you. You're not going to go to the cross. Jesus says, get thee behind me, Satan. And here's some tuberculosis till you figure it out. <laughs> Did he do that? He didn't do stuff like that. Yet we go around thinking that God's teaching people and afflicting them when Jesus said it's the thief that comes to steal, kill, and destroy. And that He's come that they might have life.